what's happening around the world. It's time for another serving of news bites. 最近国内外发生哪些大事？午餐搭配 ISRT News Bites， 慢慢的一口接一口，吸收最新时事和趣闻。Hi there, it's time for another episode of News Bites. I'm Nancy Sun, and I'm Paz Bueno. In today's news, helping Formosan black bears, saving the planet with hair, and plum blossoms for Lunar New Year. All that and more coming up next. Top of Taiwan. 发现台湾黑熊通报有奖励金 Cash prize for sighting Formosan black bear. The Formosan black bear is an important part of Taiwan. They are black all over, except for a white V marking on their chest. They are the biggest land animal native to the island, and they are Taiwan's only native bear species. <laughs> 台湾黑熊是台湾特有种的黑熊，也是台湾陆地上最大型的食肉动物。But they are endangered. They face danger from illegal traps, hunters, and loss of habitat. Now the Forestry Bureau is awarding 奖励 people who help protect Formosan black bears. It gave a man in Hualien eight thousand NT. Manama is a member of the Bunun indigenous people. He got the reward for seeing a Formosan black bear and reporting it to officials without hurting the bear. And he let the bureau set up cameras on his property to see what the bear was doing. Manama says his son told him last month that one of their chickens was eaten by a wild animal. Manama told forest officials. The officials also found black bear fur and feces, then being close by. They all took steps to encourage the bear not to come back to the village. This is done to keep both the villagers and the bear safe. Manama says it was the first time he had seen a Formosan black bear in the fifty years he's lived in the village. He says he did not hurt the bear because the Bunun people deeply respect the animal. Going global. 回收头发助吸油 Recycled hair helps protect the environment. Hair is an important part of our body. It helps us stay warm, and it protects important parts of our body too. But did you know it can also protect the environment? A Belgium company is turning human hair into mats, 垫子 It collects hair from hairdressers, 美发师 All the hair is put into a machine. The machine weaves, 编织 the hair into a mat. These hair mats can soak up a lot of oil from water. 剪下来的头发可以回收制成吸取油污的垫子 The company says one kilogram of hair can absorb 吸收 around eight liters of oil. That's about thirty-two cups. The mats can be used to clean up oil spills, 石油泄漏 or they can be used to clean drain water, 废水 Before the water is put back into rivers and oceans, the company says one strand of hair can hold up to ten million times its own weight. Hair is also elastic, 有弹性的 and it absorbs fats and chemicals like oil and pesticides, 杀虫剂 The company says hair mats help the environment in many ways. It cleans up pollution. The hair that would have become garbage is turned into something useful, and it's easy to get more hair because we keep growing more. Today's feature: 春节有机会赏梅 plum blossoms to bloom for Lunar New Year. What are you doing over the Lunar New Year holiday? This year's Lunar New Year holiday will be ten days long. If you'd like to get out and enjoy nature, you might consider going to see plum blossoms, 梅花 
Farmers in Taichung say this year is the first time in 40 years that you may be able to see plum blossoms over the Lunar New Year. They say usually plum blossoms bloom a month before the Lunar New Year. 专家说，梅花通常都是在农历春节前一个月左右开花。But this year, the Lunar New Year comes a bit earlier, and plum blossom trees are blooming a bit later than usual. They say there are now flower buds, 花苞 on plum blossom trees. The farmers think the plum blossoms will probably start blooming this week, and the blossoms will be in full bloom next week. The recap. So, in today's news bites, the Forestry Bureau is awarding people who help protect Formosan black bears. Manama, a member of the Bunun Indigenous People, got the reward for seeing a Formosan black bear and reporting it to officials without hurting the bear. He says the Bunun people deeply respect the animal. A Belgium company is turning human hair into mats. These hair mats can soak up a lot of oil from water. The mats can be used to clean up oil spills or clean drain water before the water is put back into rivers and oceans. And farmers in Taichung say this year is the first time in 40 years that you may be able to see plum blossoms over the Lunar New Year. The farmers think the plum blossoms will probably start blooming this week, and the blossoms will be in full bloom next week. And that's all for today's episode of News Bites. This week, we want you to have your say about trying something again. Sometimes we want to do something great, but maybe we can't do it right. And later, we wish we could redo it or do it again to see if we could have done it better. So, if you could redo anything in your life, what would you change? Record your message and send it to newsbytes at icrt.com.tw with your name and age, and if you'd like the name of your school, make sure to send us your recording by Thursday at noon, and you might hear your message on our show on Friday. ICRT 与教育部国民及学前教育署，下次继续和您聊新闻。ICRT App 和网站也能重复收听。More local and international news next time on News Bites, brought to you by the K-12 Education Administration. Find past episodes available on the ICRT website and app.